question really was asking how homogenous the Rastafari movement is. Is is it one does it appear one way or is there many dimensions? I would say that there at, at its core Rastafari is one central and solid movement with uh, some key signifiers. The inspiration and, and leadership that His Majesty provides is where everything starts. The focus on Africa as the claim that we know can work for us all and, and us as a part of Africa's solution and not as a part of Africa's problem becomes another um, component of that. Now, how one choose to manifest their individual liberty is subject to man's own idiosyncrasies, but we still expect high moral standards. And, and if that is absent, then we question whether the person is really in the fullness of Rastafari. So it is homogenous to the extent that I think it is a core and, and centralized Pan-African voice with, with key inspiration and key target. But individuals, I mean, some man want to fly him locks, some man want to wrap him locks, some man don't want locks. Um, you know, and, and, and His Majesty allows us that flexibility. You know, um, if we, we look at him, um, he, he, he accepts us with what we come to him with. Um, the question of rituals, I think, is the next issue where baptism is concerned. Now, especially in the West, the elders used to say that the Ethiopian identity could only be had through baptism. So, for example, when the Ethiopian Orthodox Church arrived in Jamaica in 1970, 800 elders baptized in one day within that church. Church was sent by His Majesty and once embraced it. Subsequently, there were issues because some felt that the church didn't honor His Majesty enough, but our direction through His Majesty is that this is our church and this is how we become African because this is an African church. The question about um, the, the brethren I think he's correct, you know. You can't say you're a Rastafari and not hold high honor and regard for his majesty and, and study that emperor. Because it, it is from him that the foundation of our understanding pours. And um, in, in the same way that those who are Christians draw their inspiration from the Bible, we draw our inspiration from his life example and his words. And we are, we are aware of some of the criticisms that people um, shine upon him, but we also understand the space that he occupied and the nature of the world that he found himself in. The, um, I think the others were comments, so I'll pass the mic.